Simon, welcome to the race course. You just signed a, a loan contract till the end of the season, uh, short term from Harrogate Town. Um, welcome, Been a pleasure to be here. Thank you. Thank you. I'm really uh, glad to be here. Um, really looking forward to coming and helping the boys push for promotion now. Your, your recent career with Harrogate has been contrasting. You, you signed as a defender, I believe got put up forward almost a little bit of an emergency to act as cover, and you've suddenly found that goal scoring touch that everybody's after. Yeah, yeah, it's a strange past year, really. Probably um, this time last year, I got put up front and I went on to score about 35 goals, which you know no one could have imagined. So yeah, it's been a, it's been a massive uh, change for me, and I'm looking forward to sort of stepping up another league and showing that I can do it at that level. Obviously, going going more recently, you had a little bit of an injury before Christmas. Which, which um, obviously left somebody else in the same. I think Mark Beck was probably one of the players who was here for a short period as well. Uh, and obviously Harrogate doing very well, top of the table at the moment. Yeah, they're doing really well. Um, yeah, I had um, a groin problem which kept me out for about three months, um, which were a bit of a, a nightmare after the start of the season with such good form. Um, but obviously I'm back fit now. I've been back for a couple of months and yeah, so I just can't wait to get going again. Gives you an opportunity to play football and get it back hopefully amongst the goals. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm coming here to do. Hopefully, I can add add a bit of a physical presence up front um, and do the the ugly side of things and add and chip in with a few goals as well. Your career started with Bradford, your hometown team. That's a youth team player. Yeah, we're at Bradford since I was uh, you know ten years old, all the way through to first team level. Um, so yeah, I've, I've seen uh, the uh, ups and downs at Bradford. To be fair. And obviously moved to Bradford, you went across the city, I believe, to Bradford Park Avenue next? Yeah, I've had um, a short stint at Bradford Park Avenue for a, a year um, uh, before moving on to Geisley, uh, where I, I was there for about three years, um, all playing central defender. Um, and then from there I went on to Luton, um, yeah. where, which were, who were a big team in this league. And, and I was there for a year, and then I moved back up north and went to Halifax. Um, same in this league, um, got to the playoffs, uh, playoff semi-final there against Cambridge. Um, did another the next year as well there, and then I signed for Bradford Park Avenue uh, for a year. Yeah. And you, your performances there and took Sam Weaver, took you on full time then as Harrogate. Yeah, I went, I went, well I went to Harrogate uh, part time, um, so I did the first year there part time, and then obviously there was there was a change in my position, there was a change in the club that they were going full time. Um, and things sort of just, it, it was a challenge for me because, you know, I wanted to test myself, see how well I could do playing up front at full time when I'm fit and uh, obviously I get more chance to practice and really dedicate myself to football. So it's been, um, yeah, it's been a bit of a whirlwind year for the good. Um, and this just sort of adds to my, uh, my, my journey, what I'm on at the minute and, you know, I'm, I really can't, can't wait. You've been right across the division, say Northern Premier, Conference North, Conference National, Football League. So you know the level, you know what's expected, certainly. Yeah, yeah, I'd like to think so now. I've been about around this level and and higher and lower for the last, you know, 10 years, I'd so, say. So I think one of the things I noticed about coming to Wrexham is that I think there's a lot of lads with similar sort of uh, experience to me. Um, and, and yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. Do you know how the move came about? Was it uh, was it a bit of a surprise to you, or had Dean been there? Uh, been... uh, well, I've, like, I've I've always made it clear that I've I've wanted to test myself higher, um, and there were a couple of things in January it might have might have happened, but it just didn't come to fruition. And and then this opportunity come up, and you know, as we've said, it's a it's a huge club at the level. It's a club on the way up. You know, it, I think it's exciting times here. Um, so it, for me, it was really a no-brainer when you know when the opportunity came up. So, yeah. Excellent, thank you, and we we'll look forward to seeing you on the pitch. Hopefully, this weekend. Brilliant.